Hi guys, it's Bella and welcome to Beauty on a Budget and Questions and Answers Day 3. Um, I've tried to cover a few questions in the in sort of the three days I've done it, but I know I haven't given quick yes or no answers, so I haven't been able to cover all of them. Um, but what I've done is I've jotted them down in a book, um, in my journal, so every now and again I will pick out one of those questions and tag it onto the end of a video maybe or maybe make another video on questions and answers but I didn't just want to give you a yes or no answer because um, it's, it's more than that isn't it I just wanted you to know I want you to get to know me and you're not going to get to know me with yes or no are you? <laughs> right so I've got a couple of today now I've got one of my subscribers Tan Tan for it wonderful answers all the time supports me all the time says lovely things thank you tent and i really appreciate it i really do appreciate it and your questions might need a whole video for this one it's um where do i live work how i met baz and would i do a nail care routine um Last one first again because it's easy. Yes, I certainly will do a nail care routine. Um, I've got the first couple of months of schedules. I've got to the end of February in my schedules um, done. So in there is somewhere, I'm not sure which week, but there is a nail care routine in there. I'll definitely do that for you, 10, 10, okay? Um, I, where I live, I live in the north of England. Um, where I work... Um, I think I've said before I don't work anymore um, because I have a disability um, but when I did work um, I was personnel manager for um, a large store um, and then after that for a little while I, I trained personnel managers for, for the same company so yes I had a nice job um, but things happen don't they that we don't expect in life and uh, now I'm just uh, happy to be at home and um, plodding along and doing my thing and loving YouTube. <laughs> so uh, thank you, Tan Tan. Oh, where I met Baz? We met um, through a mutual friend online. Um, it was kind of a game site. Um, and one of my friends did it and we all got chatting and um, we met up and... Yeah, Baz and I sort of clicked straight away, really. Um, he's quite shy, um, and I've always liked shy people. Um, and he's, you know, he, he's had his knocks in life. And I think sometimes when you're older, when you meet, because we've been together um, 11 years, um, and we've been married seven years um i think when you meet someone when you're older in life like that your expectations are different aren't they um although the yeah of course it's romantic love there has to be that but there's also something much deeper um an understanding and an understanding of each other that uh, we've both been knocked and you know had some upsets in our life and we sort of uh, know that in each other and um, yeah I think that I think that's great and uh, we're friends as well we're friends as well I mean it's not hearts and flowers you know I could murder him at times and he could murder me <laughs> I'm sure. But at the end of the day, it's a normal relationship that has ups and downs and struggles. And But we do all those things together. We do the ups and downs together. We struggle together. Um, and so it works. It works fine. And, uh, yeah, it's good, man. It's a good man. <laughs> okay, ten ten. I hope that helps you with um, those answers, and I will do that now tutorial. I promise you. In um, not fit to do it now. 
this new Avon one I've got on, I'll list it below, isn't it? It's nice, isn't it? It's quite metallic -y. Um, I'll do that, I'll list that below and I promise you I will do that for you in the new year. So thank you Tan Tan again for all your answers you give me and all the support. Um, now the next question, two questions, is um, from Erica. Um, she's a friend in Kentucky. She's um, one of my subscribers, I'm one of her subscribers and um, she's, a, she's a great girl. So first question she asks is what is my favorite flavored ice cream trust Erica what is my favorite flavored ice cream um I like the flavor that you can eat three saucepans full and lose two pound <laughs> oh, I love ice cream I absolutely love ice cream um any flavor I just I just love ice cream I expect if I could pick I like um, I like the fishy food who does that Ben and Jerry's isn't it Ben and Jerry's fishy food and I like their cookie dough so if I could choose probably the two most fattening ones um, but if I could choose I, I, I like those but I love any ice cream ice cream is one of my favorite foods if not my favorite I just love ice cream I don't eat a lot of it I have in the house because I just eat it on never be out of control so <laughs> but I love ice cream I love ice cream the other question she asked me is what was my favorite gift that I received as a child now this was a really easy one to think of um when I was about five or six and um, my mum was taking about six my mum was taking me to school um, we had to go through the main road part and they were building the local technical college and um, obviously it's been there years now but um, it was quite a, a modern building at the time you know it was one of those first sort of concrete looking buildings and um, they were building that because they had all the barricades up round like you know when they, they do construction and they had a crane, a huge crane, and I was so fascinated by this crane. I used to stand outside the library, which was, was opposite where they were building the college, with my mum, holding my mum's hand down, I was only little, and I would look at this crane and, uh, going up and down and picking the things up. My mum used to say, come on, we're going to be late for school. And then when she picked me out from school, come on, tea's ready, come on. <laughs> but I just used to stand there, look, I loved the crane. Anyway, that went on for a couple of months, and then the following Christmas that came, um, and when all my friends got tiny tears and Barbie dolls, I got a crane. <laughs> I was so chuffed with it, and I was such a girly girl as well. You can imagine, I was such a proper little girl, and um, but I just loved this crane, and. It was all metal, can you imagine those years ago things weren't made like they are now. And you turn the wheel and the, the arm used to come down and pick something up and then you turn the wheel. <laughs> and I used to love it. So my favourite toy by far, it came to my mind straight away, is I really loved that little crate. It was really great. Um, and I loved, I, I had a tiny tears, I think they still got them, don't they? She wets herself and drinks and I think they still do those. And then I had a, um, a doll called Tressie. Does any of you remember Tressie? She used to have a big button in her tummy and you pulled it and her hair grew. It was like, <laughs> there was a bit hole in her head like that and you pulled it and her hair, a bit like mine. <laughs> You pulled it and her hair used to come out of this hole and she'd have long hair all round her and then you'd push the button again oh there was a key, a key and you put it in the back and you turn and the hair would go crank, 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 crank <laughs> and it'd go back in her head I wonder if any of you remember Tressie then I had Cindy Cindy didn't look like she does now uh, even if there's Cindy still out she had a completely different face and she was all rubber um, not the hard stuff like um, Barbie was made of she was just soft squidgy rubber um, and she had a little sister called Patch let me know if any of you remember these and um, what was her boyfriend's name I can't remember what her boyfriend's name because Ken's Barbie's boyfriend isn't it? 
um, <laughs> so I had all the normal things that you know little girls would want and I loved all those things um, and I who else remembers these do you remember those um, high heel shoes they were like um, kind of perspex and uh, like little high heel shoes you could wear and they had elastics over them that you put them onto your feet that hold them onto your feet but you used to think they was high heels <laughs> does anybody I bet nobody remembers them but me <laughs> so I had them um, but yes definitely my favourite present was without doubt um, my that's it guys that's it for day three i will be back tomorrow day four um <laughs> and i'm just going to do tomorrow um a bit of chatting a bit of telling you what i want to do with my channel um a little bit of advice from you to see where you want me to go because obviously i do it for you so i want your input where you want me to go and I want to give a couple of shout outs to a couple of people um, that are very special to me um, and you are all very special to me and thank you again for watching my channel and for your support I hope you're all ready for Christmas and I will see you again tomorrow take care guys take care bye now